Welcome to the COP TV, the voice of football's most famous stand. Hello, and welcome back to the COP TV. Now you might notice that I'm wearing a beautiful shirt. That's because this video is the honest review of the 2021-2022 Liverpool away kit with Nike. Look at this absolute beauty. I'm up on the rooftop today, so I can't give you the full view. But yes, guys, I have gone for the vape in it again, as you can see, with the really stretchable material. I wanted to give you uh, a few more details about this shirt. Remember, before we get into those, do yourself a favor. Give this video a like, give it a share as well. Uh, and of course, uh, comment with your thoughts on the kit. And of course, subscribe if you haven't already. So like I said, made from sustainable materials, this one. Nike really going big with that uh, in terms of the messaging around the shirt this year. But essentially the colours, what are they? They're fossil and bright crimson. Now I know that I got uh, a bit of stick in the last uh, kit review video for saying it was crimson and not orange. It's literally what it says on the website. So you can't blame me, blame Nike. Um, yeah, so fossil and bright crimson. People thought it was an ecru, much like the 96 home shirt. Um, but this one is recycled polyester used in Nike products begins as recycled plastic bottles and these are clean shredded into flakes and converted into pellets to make the kit they're spun into high quality yarn delivering peak performance with a lower impact on the environment in addition to reducing waste recycled polyester produces up to 30% lower carbon emissions and virgin polyester uh, and Nike diverts an average of 1 billion plastic bottles annually from landfill waterways and it's uh, the whole move to zero project that they've got going there towards zero carbon and zero waste and it's all about how you can save the planet really and that's what they're doing with this shirt now let's get into what it actually looks like again as you guys know I did go for the vapor knit version this was 104 pounds and 595p of course the stadium version is available as well that's 69.95 but i did get this in the official club store in liverpool one just uh, across the corner and if you get a bit close up you can see again that the nike tick is uh well it's embossed it comes out of the shirt it's very breathable and a big fan of the collar as well uh, which actually contradicts my my, my, my favorite kits really because none of them from memory have a collar on but I have to say, without just saying it, and I, do, I say it because I mean it, this is without doubt the best away kit we have had in years. Let me know in the comments if you agree with that. Let me know if you think we've had any better. But realistically, this one right here, I'm praying that it's a good one um, in terms of good memories on and off the pitch in it. But what a colour though. I mean, you can't really beat the fact that Liverpool have come to Nike first and foremost, but to actually produce a kit like this, uh, I think is much better to be honest than last season's kit uh, in terms of the away offering there. Um, but this is an absolute beauty. You've got the, the dark grey, the white and the, the crimson uh, and then the fossil kind of combining it. Actually, do you know what? It could even pass for a casual shirt just to be wearing out with this little collar. It's very smart. I've actually gone for the XL. I've gone to size up uh, than I usually would just for that breathability and obviously with the vape in it it is going to be tighter anyway um, so let me know in the comments do you guys think that this kit is going to give us good memories where uh, are we going to play well in it you know what would be interesting as well if you could guess a player out of the current Liverpool squad that when he's wearing it next season will score in it will it be I don't know I'm trying to think of when we might wear this kit It'll probably be worn at Man United who do you think will score in this beauty I'm actually going to go with Curtis Jones to score the first goal for Liverpool in this kit. And we'll come back to this video if, uh, if that actually does happen. But uh, no, I'm a big fan of it. As you can see, they've gone with the old LFC logo. You've got the standard chartered there. The bottom of the shirt with the, the engineering kind of aspect of it gives you a serial number there. And it really is just smart. And I do think Nike have outdone themselves and really performed, I wouldn't say a lot better, but I definitely prefer this kit as uh, in comparison to the, the away kit last season. The other thing about this, obviously it does come with the built-in sleeve sponsor, which is this year Expedia. You can, if you want, there's space there to, to get some kind of Champions League logo. Um, but again, with the, with the vape in it, what you will find 
is it is more stretchy, but at the same time, you can't deny the fact that the quality is a lot better in terms of the physical touch than the stadium version. Now, let's be honest, the fact that Nike have introduced the Vaping It version is a money-making tool, of course, but in my head, every single kit I've ever owned was a stadium version in terms of just cotton with a woven in um, tick or a, an emblem, Adidas, Umbro, Puma, whatever that may be. It's always been woven in. And now last season with, with the introduction of Nike, what we've now found is that kit that we've all known the, the, the feel and the touch of it is now kind of been second choice. And now this is what people are pushing down your throats. And there have been a lot of um, comments really from from Liverpool fans to say that it is a joke how much it is it is very expensive I mean if you told me 10 years ago even that a Liverpool kit would cost over 100 pounds I would have laughed in your face back in I say back in my day I'm not that old I'm 27 uh, you know not older um, but back in my day you could buy the shorts the, the socks and the kit with probably a name on the back for probably 40 50 quid tops now if you want the the kit the name on the back, the shorts, the socks, I'm not going to lie to you, you're looking at around, if you want the stadium version in adult, you're probably looking around the £150 mark, which is a bit heavy. Um, as you can tell, I mean, a lot of people quite rightly have said that they're not going to buy it because of the price, and you can kind of see that, um, because again, it is just so expensive, but the quality does match up to the price. Um, whatever way you want to take that comment, I'm not saying that the price is warranted, but what I am saying is, once you actually get this shirt and you stick it on and you see how breathable it is, you can see why the players um, would wear this exact, this exact shirt. The fossil element as well is really interesting. Um, like I said, in 96, we had the Ecru shirt and when this was leaked, a lot of people thought it was a remake of that, that had a crew neck. And I guess it is quite similar in terms of the color. I mean, fossil and Ecru, what's the, the big difference there I'm not too sure but um, let me know in the comments if you guys have already got this I am aware that this kit did come out a week ago slightly uh, slightly behind on in terms of making this video as you guys all know I love making kit videos as soon as they come out with Liverpool so big up to Nike for making such a beautiful away jersey for the 2021 2022 season I can't wait to see Big Verge in it personally um, we all know how long he's been away for. I think he's going to suit this kit down to the ground. Uh, yeah, so let me know if you've already got the kit. Let me know if you're planning to buy it. Let me know how you feel about the price. And let me also know who you think is going to score the first goal in this kit for Liverpool next season. Get in there, the boys. Remember, guys, if you haven't already, I'm trying to get to 10K before Christmas. Press subscribe. Doesn't take a lot for you to do. Press like as well. And don't forget Hot Copics with James Redmond coming very very soon indeed there you go there's your honest kit review for the 2021 2020 away kit by nike i'll see you soon take care much love and you never walk alone whoa 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 just before you go don't forget give us a like drop us a comment and subscribe to the cop tv the voice of football's most famous stand